Hi guys! So, ngayon, basic digital painting tayo using brush tool. Tapos, pati understanding ng transform sa selection tools natin. Okay? Let's start. So, mag new tayo. Okay? 1920 by 1080 ang ating ang ating dimensions. May pic pixel siya. Resolution is 150. Now, okay. Let's create a title. So, title lang nito is EC DigiPaint with Transform. Okay? Create. So, okay. So, ngayon, hindi ako magagawa ng sarili kong character for today. Magmamerge na lang ako ng character just to show the Transform tool. Okay? So, ang character natin today, ang gagamitin kong character, pwedeng character na iba gamitin nyo, pero sa akin, Dahil mahilig ako sa The Simpsons, Bart Simpson, gawa ni Matt Groening, tapos uh, Pikachu, Pikachu, gawa ni Atsuko Nishida, pati ni Ken Sugimori, okay? Ng Pokemon. Game Freak. Okay. Copy ko muna si Bart. Copy image. Copy image. Then paste. Dito yon. Pag copy image na sa net, you can edit, then paste. Alright? So, yan. Okay. Lagay ko muna si Bart dyan. Then, from my layer, change layer title name to Bart. Okay? Alright, Bart Simpson. Then, next is, I will copy, copy my Pikachu, my chosen Pikachu. Copy, right click, copy image, then paste. Paste Pikachu. So, ito na. So, masyadong malaki for our canvas tong Pikachu na to, diba? Dito na papasok yung transform tool. Click nyo tong move tool, okay? Then image, move tool, move tool, then image, ay, then edit. Then go to free transform. Again, move tool, then edit, then free transform. Free transform. Okay. Ito sa taas, itong mga settings sa taas dito, pwede nyo nang ibahin by width, by height. Depende sa percentage. Pwede nyo i-lock, ganyan. So let's say I want to lock so, gawin natin, ang width niya is around, sabihin natin, 20%. So, it's a bit too small, di ba? So, let's say, let's make it uh, 50%. So, malaki pa rin. Siguro around 40. I think 40 is fine. Alright? So, yan. Pwede rin, gamitin nyo itong mga bounding box. Bounding box. Tapos, eto, mga points na to. Kapag lumabas yung icon na yan, pwede nyo nang i-resize. Okay? I-resize nyo na siya. Yan. So, okay. Okay? So, alright. So, another tip. Kapag nakalock yan, proportionate yung pag-resize nyo. Pag in-unlock nyo yan, balik tayo kay Pikachu, may stretch nyo. Pero I don't prefer stretching na muna. Okay? So, yan lang. Constraint proportion natin. So, I think I'm happy with the size na ito. Then, again, go to Bart, edit his size as well. Go to edit, then free transform. I think this is good enough for me. Okay? Now, ngayon, rename yung layer ko na Pikachu. So, okay? So, as you can see, ito na siya. Gusto kong kunin yung yung head ni Pikachu using my selection tool. So, I'm going to use polygonal lasso tool muna. Napag-aralan natin to last meeting. So, or last video din ang discuss natin to. So, select ko muna yung outside. So, marching ants. Ayan, may marching ants na makikita nyo. So, pwede ko na ngayon i-copy. Control C or copy. Tapos, pag pinaste ko, yung head niya lang. I turn off the layer here and on. So, there you go. So, 
Pikachu head. Okay? Then, same as Bart. Gusto ko naman, tanggalin yung head niya. So, select, 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 select. Then, press delete or backspace. So, there you go. Wala na yung head niya. So, okay. But, again, ulitin ko. I want to save this na rin. So, ulitin ko. Yan. So, selected. Spacebar for hand tool. Kapag naka-zoom in kayo. Then, delete. Okay? So, ngayon, meron na tayong headless board pati Pikachu head. Okay? So, select move tool. Then, I want to turn Pikachu's head over the left side. So, again, free transform or transform flip horizontal. Okay? So, yan. Para mabilis tayo, control T, then right click, flip horizontal or flip vertical. Anyway, horizontal ang gagawin natin. Alright. So, I think sapat na ba yung size or I think happy na ako sa size niya. Okay. So as you can see, there there is an overlapping line. So para makita natin 'yon, go here, baba ng opacity, then 'yan. So there you go. So I want to erase this part of Pikachu's head and this part Okay. Then, open again. Alright. Then, I can use the brush tool to add another. Alright. So, yan ang aking Pikachu. So, hindi pa ako happy dyan. I think, I, dadagdagan ko pa siya ng element, ha? So, I want the tail of Pikachu. So, kumuha na rin ako. So, thank you, Cool To Be Kids, for this coloring material of Pikachu. Copy image, then back to Photoshop, paste. Then again, selection tool, I use polygonal, or you can use anything selection tool. So, kahit itong... Okay? Copy, then paste, then delete, or not delete, just turn off na lang. Then, I put tail then okay go here to your layer then I want the tail to be below Bart's Bart's body diba so ayan I cannot see so you could do is select Bart layer or select your cartoon name layer whatever so Bart then you can choose magic wand tool eto na so, magic one yung white, delete, magic one yung white, delete, or shift to add selection, then delete. Or you can do, I want to delete them all, I want to make it transparent yung body ni Bart, select, similar, right click similar, then delete. Yung body ni Bart, ay, delete, delete. Right click, similar. So, kukunin niya lahat ng whites na pixels. So, yan. Delete. So, I want to do that to Pikachu's head. Then. Okay. Delete. Okay. Sa tail din. I'll make it transparent din. So. Okay. Pikachu's head. Transparent, 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 transparent. Okay, get the picture, I think. So, masyado maliit. Select ko yung white na yun. Delete. Okay. So, go. Tail, ayusin. I want to put it. Move tool, then... Wait. Then... Edit image. Okay, a quick reminder lang ulit ha. When you selected, you have a selected element. When you don't want to to select that marching ants na, you can right click, right click, then deselect. 
deselect okay so yan so ngayon I want to move the tail so I can just move pero if I want to rotate syempre you go to free transform again okay so look at this icon and outer so ibig sabihin yan rotate alright so rotate I want to put the tail around here I guess so mas dynamic alright then I want to erase this excess okay so yan na I have it na so right now sa layers I want to select tail bar and pikachu head then right click merge layers look for merge layers okay okay merge again you can press shift to select all the layers or control control or command when you're on mac right click merge layers okay there you go i have a one layer already let's call it bart kachu okay there you go so ito na i want to put it on top then delete the other layers na rin i don't need it na eh. so okay next is now we start coloring so next is or value painting all right not really coloring right now select this new layer then title is value fill okay value fill then hold select put it down Bart Kachu there Bart Kachu value fill now I use my polygonal lasso tool to select the outer outer part of Bart Kachu okay so there you go select that select 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 so it's a tedious process pero kapag simple yung character nyo I think it's fast din naman oh see this I will clean up that part later I miss that part so right so again digital painting is very easy if you know what you're doing but if you're a beginner I think this will help you a lot okay there you go I'm selecting I'm selecting selecting I selected them all then select this part paint bucket tool so if you cannot see it maybe it's your on gradient press it hold it then paint bucket tool all right let's go back so yan so fill I want to select a tone a value of gray hmm, about mid okay then color it there you go so see, I missed this part. So I need to clean it. So go back to Bart Kachu. Sorry. So deselect. Press your marquee or whatever selection. Deselect. Then I'm going to clean this using eraser. I'll erase this part. Alright. I think I'm okay with that. So, all right then clean up this later okay then look I have a hole here right so you can use eraser tool or selection no worries just go back to your fill go back here go back here there you go just erase it or you can use your lasso tool much easier and much faster and much precise Okay, in la kadale. Okay, let me see it again. So, is it okay na? I think it's okay na. Now, deselect. Right click, deselect. 
okay so there you go i have values fill all right so i think i'll select them both the layer then move tool i want to put it on the middle so there you go so okay now let's create a new layer new layer so let's put a title of our blocking blocking values all right or blocking when it comes to traditional drawing or painting illustrating blocking the values so now press alt okay hold alt sorry hold alt then you will see this hold your alt or or what's this or option button when on mac then you will see this icon when you put your your mouse in the middle or your cursor in the middle so ayan makikita nyo nalabas yan click so what you did right now is minask nyo na so game sample let's choose a different color then write on it on the mask there you go hindi na lumalag ay nandun na siya sa loob hindi lalagpas yung paintbrush nyo okay then if you unmask it will show so okay so dahil na block nyo ay na yung value fill nyo na kulayan nyo dun lang siya yung mask kung ano yung pixel na may kulay okay so yan so i think i'll delete this then make another blocking or there you go my blocking values again blank layer so now what i need you to do is create a layer again okay then select this then ayan make a palette palette okay so your palette is create brush tool create a four values of grace lang muna mas maganda kung meron kayong six values of gray pero this one is for for exercise lang naman and just to get a hang of digital painting lang so i think four values of gray are enough na muna and this is not your, our own artwork din naman eh. this is not our own character so this is just for an exercise so i think okay and next i think like this again lighter shade so all right so ito na yung aking aking values okay tone values ko so nasa palette so go back to your blocking values blocking values layer click it all right so yan so ngayon tinuruan ko kayo dati mag blend right like new layer muna tayo yung blending ng by brush i-on nyo to diba yung opacity sa taas so hard brush lang gamit ko so ito yun hard brush hanapin nyo I want it hard brush. So hard hard brush, okay? So select using alt pressing pressing eyedropper shortcut the alt you can blend, diba? So ito mas matagal pero I prefer this kind of method for me. This is much easier for me and mas painterly. Mas nakukuha ko yung painting style kapag ito yung ginagamit kong method. So yan. So makita nyo medyo blended na siya pero hindi siya ganun ka blend dahil hard brush yung ginamit natin so see parang blended na siya so balik tayo ng blocking values layer now let's block your your values na so turn off na muna itong opacity opacity pressure para solid lang lagi so i need to start on my darker areas so select the darker area so i think if you have a basic grasp of of lighting it's easier na so what i'm doing is very very fast lang na blocking so i guess hindi to perfect na ano ha? representation ng pagbabalues painting 
Okay? This is not a perfect representation of values painting. In fact, this is the opposite. So, this is for an example lang. So, yan. So, I think, ganyan. Ganyan, ganyan, ganyan. Okay? Don't worry about masyadong perfect na pag ano pag blocking pero mas maganda kung maayos na agad yung blocking nyo from the start mas okay agad yung magiging result when we use the mixer brush blocking so there you go again I repeat this is not a perfect representation of values painting this is just for an exercise so if you're advanced viewer viewing this or watching this I think medyo may inis ka dahil hindi ito yung perfect value painting okay hmm I'm not I'm not happy with the Pikachu eye maybe I'll change it for a Bart Simpson eye later okay so there you go so next is choose another choose another choose another value lighter Okay, when, when it comes to value painting talaga, you don't use ultra, like, super white or deep blacks talaga. Just grays lang din. It's easier naman din to, call, to change the, the contrast when you're painting digitally rather than traditionally. So, I think, just be mindful. Okay. So, ayan na aking blocking. I think it's okay. Perfect blocking. So, alright. So, ngayon, what I want you to do is create a new layer. Then, type blending. Blending. So, okay. Meron na kayong blending layer. So, alright. Click, hold click your brush tool here. Then look for mixer brush. Mixer brush. So, what I want you to do is select a brush. Again, for now, hard brush tayo. Then unclick this. Click this. Then this, this area, you can choose what kind of mixer brush you will want. Try to experiment, but for now, type this on your wet, load, mix, and flow, okay? Then turn on this. Turn sample all layers and turn your pressure on, okay? This is for pen tablet users. Well, if you're not using pen tablet, you cannot turn the pen pressure on. Right, blending layer, okay, check. Now try blending okay but the black will blend as well because we sample all layers so what I do is select the Bart Kachu outline then put the opacity around let's say I think 55 or 56 is enough so there you go you have a light outline it's okay now try to blend go back to your blending blending layer then click it, then go back, mixer brush tool ready, then try to blend now. So basic digital painting in Photoshop. So blending. So you can add more paint using brush tool again if you're not happy or if it's too dark or too light for you, if you want to add highlights, later we will do that. But, subukan nyo munang i-blend lahat. So, pag kulang pa kayo ng highlight, pati ng, ng dark tones or mid-tone ng value, dagdagan nyo na lang. 
So yeah, but this is the logic behind mixer brush and basic digital painting. So okay. So again, you can use different kinds of brushes if you want a texture brush. Game, let's sample. So I want it to look like more painterly. I'll change my brush to or uh, what what I do I want. So let's say let's say I want charcoal charcoal brush. See the effect? It's more painterly. Okay? But if you want a soft, then use soft brush. But for today, our exercise, just use hard brush. Okay? Just blend using hard brush. Okay? Just blend. Hard brush. So change your brush size. So please practice your shortcut. But the shortcut of brush is bracket near the backspace. Okay, there you go. It's blending neatly. Later, I'll change the eyes, I think. Like the Bart Simpson eyes later. So yeah, there you go. So I think a little bit of cleanup will do. So, so yeah. Oops, I missed something. Okay, here we go. So now turn off. Okay. Then you can do duplicate this. So what you can do? Right click to your layer, duplicate layer. Part get you outline okay and turn off put this on top there you go so I think the blending is not yet done let's blend this area okay turn it off okay done here turn it off so. layer multiply edit so yeah there's your Bart Kachu so clean up, use the eraser tool for clean up. Eraser or selection tool, whatever do you like, but I like. Oops. Clean this up like this. Clean up, clean up. Okay.
it's dark, you can use the levels. There you go. There's your Barkachu. Alright. So, save it. Don't forget to save it. Easy Digital Photoshop. Alright. So, okay. Thank you. So, by the way, I made this one for the exercise. So, there you go. Your Bart Kachu. I have two Bart Kachus now. Okay, thank you.